Good morning, everyone. It's like 7.30 on Wednesday. I don't want to be awake. I really need some caffeine. I'm on my way to work right now, and I am actually trying to roll. I've got my camera rigged up next to me, so hopefully that stays put, and we'll be able to kind of film my drive down. So I don't know if that's going to be in this vlog or a separate vlog, because I kind of have like a long drive, but let's go to work. So first box is here, um, as you can see, not in great condition, to be honest. Um, also, sorry if you can hear the wind, it's super windy outside right now. Um, so yeah, we're going to uh, cut this open and uh, take a look at what's inside, because I honestly don't remember. Alright, ten years later, we're finally open, and this box looks like it is some clothes. But I probably don't need, in all honesty, um, my good running sneakers are here, some more dress shoes, and then it just looks like some stuff for my desk. Yeah, a couple of, like, notebooks and some cards, and oh my god, scissors, finally. That's good. Um... Oh, my shower curtain is here, too. That's something I don't need right now. But, um, yeah, I'm just waiting on two more boxes to get here. And it's honestly, it's a lot of stuff I don't need right now because I'm still living in the hotel and will be for a few months. Um, and also, Patrick gave me a bunch of stuff tonight because he's moving, um, which I'll, uh, I'll show you in the morning. I was going to film it. Uh, when I got home, but it was dark and really windy, so I decided not to do that. So we'll take a look in the morning. And good morning, everyone. It is now Wednesday. Um, so we're at the back of my car now. This is the stuff that Patrick gave me. So I got a skillet and a spatula. I got a toaster oven, a coffee pot, a bug zapper. That's a fan. I got a gift to Steph. And then some snorkeling gear, which I am super excited about because that is absolutely something I was going to buy. So... Thanks, Patrick. Also, I just want to take a moment. I just got to work, and I want to talk about how this island has literally adjusted my driving habits. Because, like, normally when I drive, I just have one hand down here on the wheel. But I literally, like, I have to drive with my hand up here now. Because literally every single car that you see, like, you're like, you gotta wave to. Everybody waves at you. Yeah. Good morning everyone. Now it is Friday. It's my second day off this week. I am about to drive down to Manelli to the small boat harbor and I'm going to head over to Maui for the day. Um, I'm actually going to go park at work I think and then walk down to the beach and then kind of through to the harbor because I don't really want to leave my car at the beach all day. I'd rather park it at work where I know it's safe. So uh, we're going to go drive down now. Nothing left so holds on tight as a hurricane breaks to fall. Stay hidden from the causes that might let go of your hand. Take me away, I'm running for my
everyone so it is a few hours later I am home from Maui and I actually did have to cut my trip short today because we are in a high wind advisory and we've been in one since Thursday night I believe um, but basically we're getting gusts of wind up to 60 miles an hour at some points um, so they weren't sure if they were actually gonna be running the ferry all day so I was originally supposed to come back around like 3 or 3.30 this afternoon, I think, and I actually had to change my ferry time to come back around 1 o'clock instead. Um, so I really, I feel like I spent more time on the ferry than I did in Maui today, but that's fine because like really I just went over there to buy a few things. That was really all the time I needed, um, but I'll just kind of show you a few things that I got. So I just picked up some fun cactus socks um, and then just some boring gray socks but I needed more socks for work so I don't have to keep hand washing them all the time and then I got a couple of more work shirts so this one just has some nice little palm trees on it this one has some pineapples which I thought was fun also I live on the Pineapple Island, so I thought it was very fitting. And then I got the shark shirt, which I'm very excited about. And I actually, I think it was the second day that I was working there, I saw a guest wearing this. And I was like, oh my god, I'm obsessed with this shirt. And then I found it today in Maui, so I had to buy it. I was very excited about that. And then I just got um, this t-shirt that just has a cool little shark on it um and it's very soft and i just i don't know it was on sale so i got that um i got i went to one of the general stores um and just picked up a few snacks and then i also got this uh small water bottle um that i'm just going to use to bring my like iced coffee to work in the morning but that's it um for stuff that i got but yeah, the ferry ride um, out there was very, very choppy due to the weather. Um, but we got to see probably seven or eight whales um, between there and back, which is really exciting. It was a good uh, whale sighting day. Uh, and then actually when I came back, I was talking to the boys down on the beach for a while and they were telling me that uh, a mother and calf humpback whale had been hanging out very close to shore. Uh, which I guess they don't normally come that close to shore. They don't come in past the reef very often, but they guess because it looked like a newborn calf, which we actually did get to see a few minutes later, it was breaching, which is really cool. Um, but they were telling me that the mother will bring the calf in that close if there are sharks in the area. So that was pretty cool um, to see, but that was, I guess, kind of it for my Maui trip um it's very touristy there I'll say um I had a lot of anxiety kind of just being in that area um but it was I'll definitely like go back um it's a good place to go and get stuff that we can't get here on Lanai 
um, but I'm definitely gonna go back later on a day we're not in high wind advisory. I guess that will wrap up this vlog for now and um, we'll see y'all later.